If we wanted to change Anchorage, we would have to go up there, come all the way around, and go into there. Guess what? It's not happening. No way, no how, no can do. We are stupid. Are you ready for adventure? Subscribe now because we're getting ready for the great Siberian sushi run. Well, I hope you followed along last week as we made our way to Susha Island in the San Juan Islands. Well, this week, we have to stay there and you'll see why. Okay, the wind's picked up and we are going for a hike. Let's go see what the south side of this island looks like. So, we let Blaine tie up the dinghy. What do you guys think? It should work. <laughs> Tide's going down if anything, so. Tide's going down, we should be fine. Okay, let's go. I brought cookies okay. for the hike. Woohoo, we have cookies. Homemade cookies, my friend, are my niece's <laughs> Homemade cookies. <laughs> and all the woodpecker stuff. Not a bunch of peckers. <laughs> really? There's no crab chop. I can see the end of the line. Kind of cool though. It wasn't a crab chop though. It's got a tag. It's got a tag on here. That's probably original somebody's mine. decided. And she's coming here to sleep tonight. I think I might get a better sleep than here. No bumps. There you go. 26 bucks a night. 26 bucks is what it gets you. That's what it gets you. <laughs> get up there. Go to bed. Uh, I don't know if I'm going to climb up there. There you Let go. See. Do you fit? fit? There's no mattress though. There's no mattress. It's very... Look at us cleaning up the park. Okay, this is pretty cool. This is the United States Lighthouse Reserve Monument. It was set in 1895 during the second of three government land surveys. Look at that. That's kind of cool. Historical land site number, 20, number two, established 1895, restored in 1996. So that is Mushroom Rock, and last time we were here, which of course I lost all the footage with the induction stovetop, um, Blaine was climbing on it, and I think I've got a picture, you guys can see that right here, of him doing the Mario on it. Can you do the Mario on it again? Just pretend. Exactly like that. Come on, Brian, do the Mario. Yeah, no good. <laughs> Come on. 
<laughs> Fossil collecting prohibited. I guess I'm not getting collected. <laughs> I think I'm the oldest one of this group. Okay, let's check out the toilets. Oh, pretty nice. These are all composting toilets. It's really mild out. Look at how warm it is. Yeah, see, it's still swelly in here. I hang this on a tree somewhere. Woohoo! Perfect. There's somehow we can get out to that point. There's a monument out there. So I think the trail's inland there. Look at the bird. We're going this way. We're going to Henry Point. Look, steps. Russell found the steps. Maggie, look, steps. Go. Oh, yuck. That's a cool tree. Where are you going? Oh, you're both over there. What if Brian was going pee? Whoa. Oh, yeah. Oh, yuck. shallow bay where we are tucked in on the south side or on the north side because that's not fun out there you see all this torn up this is usually the raccoons they come in and they just tear it all up looking for grubs isn't that cool they just love digging in the moss <laughs> okay Ooh, steep trail we are going out on that point between both of those Underneath it. <laughs> it's very cool. It's an old arbutus tree. Look at it. Okay, we're doing the loop trail. Counterclockwise. Hey Mags, we're coming. Okay, we're pretty high. You got over it, okay? Here. It makes such a difference with poles. Okay, let's keep going. An empty shell. Snail's gone. Wow. Okay, that is really cool.
Wanna go look at the monument? Oh, she's right behind me. Oh, no, we got Maggie right here. Okay, it's a bit sketchy, Blade. Yeah. Ah! Watching here to Fino. Oh, this is a little more fun. Bring your boat to this one. Yes. If it was just a little bit higher, down here and just get totally It'd actually be really cool if it was clear because you can see Mount Baker right there. You can only see the bottom of them right now, the mountains. And can you guys believe it's seriously like December 27th? Here. Yeah, we found the monuments out here. U.S. Coast Guard Geodetic Survey. Yeah, so this is where they... 1940. <laughs> oh. He says it's for the island, not for me. No. I had to think about that one, though. <laughs> and then the wind blows the bushes, and we get like a little tunnel. What this means. Okay, we found the monument. So. Point E. V. Henry, dedicated 1973. Look at Mr. Henry with his glasses on. It's like a stamp. You can put some ink on it. Look at those waves. shite that was up we're at Susha Island Marine State Park and the Washington State Park acquired one-third of this in 52 but then they thought it was going to be developed with vacation homes and we don't want that so Seattle yachtsman Everett Henry founded the Buddhist Association of Washington they raised $25,000 and bought the whole island. So we just climbed out to Everett Henry Point and uh, that's why it was dedicated to him. So Everett, thank you. Uh-oh. Oh, Blaine. Bummer, dude. Oh, this is a pretty... Uh... This is a big crash. I'm hoping there's a beach across here. This is an older smell. I don't see it. Oh, well, there's a little tiny berm. Yeah, I think there's a berm across. There's a berm. If not, we're on an adventure. One island, just a quick walk apart. Totally different weather systems. Look at this. Look at those two boats. Look at the seal right there. Or maybe it's a log. Oh, 
it is. We found beach. What's cool about the kelp, it grows a foot a day. It's called bull kelp, it's crazy. We used to play with it and swing it around and hit each other with it. Ghost tourist, check it out. Is that cool? Yeah, that's ghost forest. And in the summertime, these are all rose bushes. In the winter, totally different. Catch up to everybody. Whew. Hey, always good when you find your dinghies again, and it's high tide, so they're kind of floating. It's a good thing being tied into that branch. What'd you happen to the dog? She almost made it. It actually is pulling the branch. Thank you, branch. Am I pushing us? Key. How far did we go? Yell it out. That's good. What a great way to work off Christmas. Okay, hold on, Blaine. Oops. That's okay. We can pull from there. Okay. We're in. That was fun. It's still gonna be rolly out here. I know. I don't care. I don't think that carburetor is 100%. No. Nope, definitely not. We're broken down. Uh oh. Really? Carburetor needs to be cleaned again. Help! <laughs> Man's gonna start swearing pretty soon. We need help! The carburetor is crapped up again, so... Please. It's so good to friends with boats. If not, we'd be paddling. And that would suck. Let's watch our line doesn't get wrapped. If you hang on to that hook and then pull me in, or we'll swing again. And this is where Janice falls overboard. So this is what's happening. Rosie had a horrible sleep last night. We're rolling and everything. So Blaine is over there with Brian. They're gonna run a stern line to that mooring ball over there. So hopefully get their stern into the swells that are coming in and their bow into the wind. We'll see how it goes. There they 
are running the stern line to keep Rosie from rocking. And they're really rocking. We're not as bad. So I lost my crab trap, but Brian had his down. He caught some dungies and I promised him that if he caught some dungies for us to eat, that I would clean them, which means I'm cleaning dungies. And let me show you these guys. Okay, let me put the crab here. Let me put this up some more. Okay, you guys see me okay? Ah! Okay, look at this one. What do you guys think? It's a good dungy, eh? Whew. And we got three of them. He, I think he was using chicken bait, which is like the key. Okay, let's clean some dungies. This one's even bigger. Whoa! Whoa! Crabs are cleaned, and now I'm just gonna cook them and take them over there to eat for appetizers. 